So what did we find out predicts divorce? And uh, the major thing we found was that, in fact, uh, the people whose marriages were headed for divorce, when they talked about an area of disagreement, there was slightly more negativity than positivity. They were slightly more hostile, defensive, angry, you know, upset, uh, really disappointed, ne slightly more negative emotions coming out than positive emotions. It was actually 1.25 times more negative than positive. But the people whose marriages were really on a course of stability and they were going to stay together and more or less like each other, you know, they were more like masters, they actually had five times as much positive stuff going on as negative stuff. So even when they were talking about an area of continuing disagreement, their marriages were very rich climates of affection, humor, interest in one another, all kinds of things going on. And one of the big puzzles we've tried to solve uh, is, you know, what makes people have access to their sense of humor when, even when they're fighting? Now in the apartment laboratory, the ratio of positive to negative was 20 to 1 rather than 5 to 1 in marriages that really were happy and on a good trajectory. So that was the first thing we found, that really a marriage has got to be a climate of a lot of positive stuff going on all the time. 